Hi, I'm David. And I'm Eileen. And we're the co-founders of Fairy Tale Brownies. I'm going to do some videotaping and Eileen's going to show you some great things that you can do with Fairy Tale Brownies. So welcome. Right now we're at the Fairy Tale Brownie Bakery. We bake thousands of brownies, cookies, and bars every day. But like David said, we're going to show you some home recipes. So let's head over to David's kitchen and we'll show you just how to do that. All right, let's go. Now we're in David's kitchen and we're going to make fairy tale browning cookie sundaes with raspberry sauce. And the raspberry and sauce ingredients, all you need are raspberries, cold water, cornstarch, a little bit of orange juice, and sugar. And then at the end we'll add our all natural ice cream with double chocolate fairy tale cookies and raspberry swirl fairy tale brownies. Put your um, cornstarch into the cold water and whisk it, and then that, that'll get added to the heated raspberries, orange juice, and sugar. Okay, now we're gonna add all these ingredients to the heat, and we're gonna bring it to a boil before we simmer it. The sugar, it's just stirring it and waiting for it to boil. It's going to get a beautiful pink. Now the color of the water is starting to change to a beautiful raspberry pink as it heats up. Okay, our sauce is boiling, so we're going to turn off the heat. And the more it cools, the more it's going to thicken. Okay, now we're assembling our sundaes. Scooping the ice cream into the bowl. Fudgy raspberry swirl brownie in the back. And then a double chocolate cookie. And then the sauce. It thickens as it cools. Just spoon it right on top. A little mint. We've got a gorgeous tray for entertaining. Here you can see we've got our final tray of fairy tale brownie and cookie sundaes with raspberry sauce. And I added a final little garnish of chocolate sprinkles on top. And again, just visit brownies.com slash recipes for this very easy recipe. Thank you for watching. Enjoy and have a fairy tale day.